Right now, my students are wondering, does Alex have ESP? I randomly picked a card and then looked at it. Then Alex tried to read my mind to predict what was on the card. He got nine correct out of ten guesses. Do you think he has ESP? Let's use Fathom to help us figure this out. Notice I created a collection with two attributes, one called card and one called guess. Let's take a look at the formula for these two attributes. Notice under the card attribute we have the command random pick and Fathom is randomly picking either a star, circle, wave, or plus. This also happens with the guess, at, guess attribute. There's a random pick of star, circle, wave, or plus. Notice sometimes there's a match and sometimes there's not. Let's create a new attribute in Fathom to keep track of whether or not there is a match. So I'm going to edit the formula for this attribute and I want to know when card and guess are equal. Notice we have a bunch of trues and falses and look at this. There was no matches here. And now we have some trues so we had some matches. Let's take a look at a graph and see how this changes. Here we had five times where there was a match and five times where there wasn't. Here we have one match, one match, three matches, another five, another two. It seems unlikely that we would get nine matches, but maybe we can. Let's use Fathom to help us count how many matches we have in each of our simulations. So let's go to Inspect Collection and you'll notice I have a measure here that I've already filled in called count, where we're going to count the number of times match is true. In other words, count the number of matches. Notice now we have six matches, and that's shown here in our bar graph as well. Let's have Fathom gather the measures for us. I really don't want five runs of my simulation. I'd rather have a hundred. So let's collect a hundred measures. And now let's take a look at a graph of those measures. So one time there were seven correct by guessing, but at no time do we get nine correct by guessing. As a matter of fact, the most common outcome was three, and we'd expect Alex to get about 25% right by guessing alone. So on average, he should get 2.5 right by guessing alone. He clearly can read minds.